Hello and welcome back to Brief Edge. I we have some at least one new place to visit. Uh, we need to equip this. The one. new suit won't reduce the core's activity, Yay. but will increase your radiation resistance, which is equivalent. Okay. Almost. Almost. Cool. Um of all the potential of the Cedar spacesuit, you managed to use only its improved material for the lining. But even this is enough to increase your chances of survival. Okay, but I still need to get that maneuver engine somehow. Okay, I have two uh, additional explosives, so there's that. I'm giving this electric. Electrician space suit. Come on. In case we will have to go through there. But you know, just two more major points to go and we will get to Normandy. Oh, we are running out of fuel. I should create some more fuel. And once again, I need to make that um, that one spacesuit that will allow me to withstand extreme temperatures. So we can explore more of the icy cooling agent and flaming hot slash in the asteroid. Even greatest our fifth journey over here to get <laughs> to open that bio module. And I hope this is the last one. They are not, they are not dangerous. Like milk, even the sour kind, though. What the heck? Please, let me. Scanning gives no results. There's no such creature in the database, but the temperature inside the capsule suggests that they also contain the cooling gel we need. Cool. Like, literally cool. Okay. Turret detected. In here? This is definitely not a cargo section, despite it looking like one in the mark in the liner's declaration. Somebody wanted to keep these rooms secret. There's no mutants inside. Um. Come on. But that still is electro. Okay, never mind then. Can I get some gravity here?
Oh, maybe I don't know. A laboratory with the most advanced equipment. Individuals don't have access to such technologies. Something tore him apart from the inside. From oh, from, oh. From the inside. Is this gonna be another body horror? Don't mind me after back snacks, it's great. A report by Dr. E. Ripley. In the report, I could not help but point out to the phenomenal survival ability of subject 14-A. As noted above, the most difficult part was not growing the experimental prototypes, but the disposing of them. Subject 14-A and similar specimens from the same control group regenerated rapidly even with a cut-off head. Mutations caused by this regeneration often change their initial appearance beyond recognition. The cells simply did not know, did not know the final form of their carrier and produced incredible forms that could not adapt to independent life. We tried to prevent this uncontrolled cell division physically, chemically and even at the DNA level, but the chicken gene always found a loophole. Research by Dr. Bako, conducted together with Dr. Dolma Dolmachov's group helped us to reveal some details of these regenerative abilities. However, they triggered something. Okay. Some mutated chicken DNA <laughs> is being examined here. Large transport module, that would be great. Looks like some data blocks. Connect me to one of them and I'll try to find out if there's any cooling gel in the capsules. Oh, you will? Interesting. There's no cooling circuit here, which means the gel can only be present at the solution itself that is poured into the capsules. The full composition of the solution is encrypted, but we can pump it out using the control post and analyze it manually. The color green perfectly calms the nervous system, relieves tension, and normalizes blood pressure. Not in all cases, though. Hmm. Even trash cans can be luxury ones, but this is not one of them. Oh, fuel crate. Just what I need. I mean, we have spare place for this stuff. According to the plan, this is not only the main control post, but also the steering wheel. This section is a space shuttle, but with such damage, it's unlikely to be able to fly. The most common way to use a desktop aquarium in space. According to statistics, every second surveyed man longs to go in a normal toilet for the opportunity of seeing the size of his organic product. Oh, okay. I've downloaded the manual. To clean the specimen capsules, press the blue button. Or the green one. Unfortunately, the manual is black and white. Something's wrong. I would suggest ignoring what happened. If these specimens end up on some planet and remain intact, then politicians will come up with some story about a super intelligent race that created these creatures to destroy mankind. Press the green button. As I thought, the capsules didn't contain all of the solution. Pumping out from the reserve tanks initiated. Examine the solution? There's no cooling gel here, but the solution contains potassium iodide, cystamine, ondansetron, and some non-standard impurities. Okay. Theoretically, it can serve as excellent anti-radiation protection. Just put the solution into the insulin cell of the suit, and I'll calculate the dosage so you don't turn into a vegetable or a mutant cow. Your protection against radiation has increased. You didn't even have to launch anything into the core, risking the start of an uncontrolled reaction of matter explosion. Although it would have been right to launch this laboratory together with all of its dangerous research. I know, right? 
So now all that's left is to repair that engine at the Mayo station. That was. But um, wait, wrong way. Wait, I'm confused. Yep, definitely. How did I get? Ugh. Come on, come on, come on, do this. Okay. Still wondering about this. Okay. Okay, never mind. I wonder, am I the only one who is confused about the fact that these specimens have chicken genes? Many blueprints specify chickens to be the main catalyst for mutations. You even have an immortal chicken in your backpack, don't you? Yes. Why would you ask? Okay, and luckily we are done with this place. Yep, we are done. My... Oh, wait. Uh, I need to... Are you up? We have something to check out over there. We can... Be inside this one? No, I don't think so. We can see a different one. Bowl of electricity. Anything in here? Have you even been here? I think so. Maybe. It's hard to tell. I see a lot, uh, lots of bottles. What? Why do you change to Xbox controls? Oh well. I'm fairly sure I was in that one. Can check it out. It has load up. <laughs> but I mean, that's what we get for having so many locations that are bigger on the inside than on the outside. For the amount of, for the amount of the of, uh, locations to load up, this game is doing really well. There's something over there. There's something over there. Hey, no, this is uh, we need to fix that. So we count that as something. So at this point I'm already lost as to what we can do in order to get that maneuver engine. I have no idea. I think we should research it, but there's nothing we can do. The only idea I have is about creating the uh, Thermal suit, go through the fires, go through the cooling gel. Must have been tons of materials. 
start us to research it, then to create it. What's up? You've seen such a lamp somewhere already. I think you could assemble one like this yourself, for some unknown purpose. Okay. Yep, I have to get there from above. Docking area in here. <sighs> so I have no idea what else we can do right now. It's empty. Can you not give me a minute? I'll I'll check it up because I don't have any other idea how to proceed. Honestly. This Oh, it's empty. Um, this is the only place I can... We know about. I have every... Here. Uh, I have everything enabled when it comes to those... Mm, map points. Small aquarium, yeah, we don't need those. Trash can, green lamp... Broken engine, yeah. Talking airlock. Okay, so be right back. And we're back. Apparently, I didn't scan all of the engines, and that's why it didn't. It wouldn't work. So as you can see now, in the items, equipment, items, there we have this shit. Generator, plastic, composite, titanium. Mm. It took me almost two hours to find out what happened. I even tried, I, I didn't try, I altered my save file. And apparently, even if you change the amount of the engines that you have scanned, it did not affect the uh, me getting the blueprint. So, in the end, I ended up with uh, uh, it actually broke the game because I did, didn't have it the one I didn't have this one engine scanned. So when I scanned it, it was 7 out of 6 engines scanned and it didn't give me the blu blueprint anyway. So I'm glad I made a backup. <laughs> but yeah, I tried searching for multiple safe editors, I searched forums, and it is the most common issue when someone uh, first goes to the fix the centrifuge than the engine later because you do not know anymore that you need to scan something and so i thought that uh, i had the same thing happen that it did with uh, high on life and i did not want to go through it again because here 
I've already put uh, almost 15 hours. Plastic to coat titanium. We don't have titanium. We have plastic. Mm. Generator. Uh, no. Generator and compensator. Wait, that's generator. Okay, electronics wire. Titanium, alkali, and titanium, alkali, and titanium. And here, how much fuel do we have left? Enough. Alkali, titanium, alkali, titanium. So, right now, I'm trying to rush it to be done with it. I'm already over the time I had this game today. At least I found that it's not that easy to find a proper. Is this the big one? Yep, that's the big one. Uh, to find a proper save file editor. Come on. Even though the save files are the same. Mm, file type is half file type. They need different programs. That's how I understand it. Compensator, generate generator and compensator, okay. After we're done with this, we can finally go to Normandy. After all that... No, I still need to find that one engineer shuttle. And I need to know what is in that boiling red hot area that that's there for a reason i have this tem temperature resistant suit for a reason not made but we have a possibility to make it so i need to find it what is it for
and then we'll have to stack up food for the journey. A number of random oh. objects. There's no logical connection. Analysis required. Analysis. So we have to here. The standard funerary set doesn't include such a color. Judging many images, we can assume. I ask you to take on board my nephew, O.P. Yuryev, who felt undergoing military psychological training for his immediate conveyance to the B-Man Center. The passenger heads to Frenia. There's no use looking for logical connection anymore. Okay. Debug. Debug. And another... Empty. <laughs> Whoa, 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 whoa. We're almost there, finally, after so much time. <laughs> the engine is installed, now the tank will probably be able to fly. Yay! At this point, I remember by heart where the door in this all this mail is located. Of course, I'm always taking the wrong way around. That's why not. Dexterity, together with incredible luck and incredibly linear strengths, works wonders. Oh. In any case, there's a decrease in the core's activity. It looks like we broke the task. The sensors detect a significant decrease in radiation. Unfortunately, so much debris got into the core that we now have even less time before it destabilizes. I recommend exploring new areas and search. I can't say for sure, but apparently it was a backup power cell of the newest nuclear warp installation in the core of the liner. What we have seen is one of the most protected. By the way, did you notice that you passed the third chapter? I think I forgot to display the text about it. What happened to the core? Why there is constant explosion? It becomes less bright. Unfortunately, it's still impossible to track the location of your interlocutor. If some kind of script doesn't trigger here right now, we'll be stuck here for a long time. But I think Chapter 4 started quite a while ago, didn't it? Seems like you did something wrong, as always. I suggest you start a new game and try again. Come to think of it, forget it. Judging by the analysis of my sensors, the launch mayonnaise was completely absorbed by the core and destabilized it. The radiation level decreased to a critical minimum. It's time to visit Normandy before it's too late. Hey, give me a moment because I didn't see it. It's enabled. Where is it? Oh, there it's... Okay, never mind. So... 
Yeah, I'm gonna spot here and I'll meet you at the Normandy. So for now, thank you very much. Stay alive and see you soon. Bye!